Yo what's up guys it's Aptrix here and finally we have the first ever playstation 3 game running on our android devices through rpcs3 emulator. Yup you heard it right guys if you have watched this video on the iCard above then you know that rpcs3 emulator now works on android devices not the proper latest stable version of rpcs3 but the old build which is the version 0.0.0.5 the alpha build of rpcs3 emulator which we managed to emulate through winlater android can finally boot games with graphics output and in today's video we'll be taking a look at its gameplay before starting a huge shout out to Kamlesh gaming he is the one who uploaded the gameplay of first ever playable game on rpcs3 emulator on android through winlater android so basically we are emulating windows version of rpcs3 emulator uh, with the help of winlater you already know we even use this method to emulate cmu and xbox simulator you can see renderer is opengl resolution is 720p and if you guys want to emulate rpcs3 on your android devices as well then the minimum requirement is snapdragon 8 gen 1 or above the device which he used has snapdragon 8 plus gen 1 processor and you will shortly see the amount of fps that he was getting it's not really great to be honest but vsync has also been enabled now let me fast forward to some rendering test uh, by the way all of the touch controls uh, is being set up using input bridge as you know in winlater android or even exagia emulator we use input bridge to add on screen touch controls and right here guys is sonic cd sonic playstation 3 trial version running on rpcs3 emulator on android we are emulating an ps3 game on a windows emulator for android that's pretty crazy but finally man i can't even believe that it's playable i am so hyped because win later android isn't a huge deal in terms of performance and compatibility but when cassia will come out it may even be able to run the original rpcs3 latest current version as you know cassia is an upcoming windows emulator for android and that's why i am super hyped let me fast forward to the part where the game actually starts by the way we are getting around uh, 1.3 to 1.4 fps that's why it's so slow and you can't really emulate any games like god of war etc bro do you want your mobile to explode or what <laughs> spider-man god of war no bro only 2d titles only homebrew games can be tested on the rpcs 3 0.0.0.5 version if we move forward you'll notice that the game actually starts and there is not even any noticeable graphical issue with this game that's the most surprising part which i found out uh, you'll notice that the game is in this square size box as this is really old rpcs3 emulator build that's why you will face some errors but i am super hyped after seeing the ps3 version of sonic mania running on our android devices now let me talk about the reality of this ps3 emulation on android scenario with the help of win later android in reality you can't really use it to emulate big titles as i mentioned previously and also you will need a super high device to get to even this point where uh, we are getting only 1.5 fps which is literally not even considered to be running you creating and slideshow is more faster than the fps we are getting right here that's why i wouldn't recommend you guys to try out this method for now but it's pretty enjoyable to see such experiments and there is a different level of joy to see some experiments succeed till early 2023 there was literally zero chance of this happening but finally uh, some miracles are indeed happening and i am super hyped for the future of emulation on mobile devices let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think about it if you are new here then be sure to hit that like button subscribe turn on all notification as i upload similar videos on my channel and also check out Kamlesh Gaming, he uploads similar experiments on his channel too. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.